Hello everyone, my name is Pixorifs, and with me again is the Cirque, and welcome back to Terraria. Hello. Hello. We're so back. We're back, we are. And today's plans have not quite gone as expected. So as you can see, we're wearing some stylish stylish new threads. I've got myself some full platinum armor, and you're rocking a wizard hat. And Ooh, yeah. You've got the, the all black. I've got my wizard hat and my kimono all dyed up Very and cool. ready. So uh, for some some shady shady business <laughs> shady dealings with the gunsmith. Yeah, we've uh, we've been doing a little bit of work off camera, folks. We've got a elevator that does actually go all the way to hell now. It is it is pretty intense, and we oh. figured we would just do do some off camera work, expand the house, maybe get a few NPCs in, improve our gear, because we are waiting for a meteor to land, and it still hasn't happened. So instead, nope. we, we kind of want to get some gear and we want to get the uh, the Eye of Cthulhu fight over and done with for you folks, because we figured like we're five or six episodes in at this point, we really don't want to like delay the boss fight, but we don't want to die horribly. So I was <laughs> thinking what we could do is, we got some gravitation potions from caving, we should probably go and look for some sky islands just to see if there's any awesome gear. So. I reckon if I go left, and maybe you go right, and we just kind of divide and conquer as far as the Sky Islands go. What do you think? That sounds fantastic. Sounds like a good plan. I've also got myself a handy double jump as well, so I'm now blizzard powered. Not quite as fancy as Cirque with the Sandstorm, Ooh, but... Sandstorm! Yeah, you're uh, you're definitely doing pretty and well with that. I have... We, we found two more Ice Blades, so... Yes, we are, we are. Iced up. <laughs> ice, ice Blades all over the place, but uh, yeah. No, and we're, we're pretty... we bought a Mini Shark. <laughs> oh yes, you got yourself a Mini Shark. And we, we bought a Mini Shark. Yes, yes. So that's, which uh, I should... Uh, I only have like 38 bullets for that thing. Let's, yeah, we pro probably need to more. probably need to restock on that, especially before the Eye of Cthulhu fight. That's going to be pretty handy. But uh, I would still there prefer laser guns, so we'll see what we can do. But in the meantime... Lasers. Lasers. Freaking sharks <laughs> with freaking lasers on their freaking heads. We're... Okay, I'm going I'm going left, you're going right. Uh, I'm going to buff with the gravitation potion, and we've got a feather fall one just in case. Let's yeah. do it. Oh, the party, party is over, <laughs> so it must be... <laughs> time for business. Yes, must be time for business, and it's time to fall into the sky, folks. All right. I got to remember how to do this. Yeah, the the up-down kind of thing. It's it's a little bit tricky to get used to, but... Wind, is, wind speed is currently six miles an hour westerly. <laughs> cloudy, cloudy conditions. I don't have the weather report anymore. Yeah, the weather radio is the, the only kind of semi-useful accessory we've got. I guess I've got my depth meter... <laughs> But uh, yeah, that is still, still the only thing we've we found like seven flare guns when we were caving. We found like we got ice mirrors now, so we can actually get our way home again. But uh, yeah, we didn't. Really oh find yeah, it. we both got ice mirrors. Yeah, which which, which is, is kind of a great kind of a score. But then, as regards everything else, we kind of didn't really get lucky with a lot of the chests we found. A couple of semi decent weapons, but then nothing to write home about really. So. I'm hoping yeah. if we find one of these Sky Islands, it will yield riches. Star Fury. Let's I hope. think that's what it's called, right? Yes. The one yeah. that, oh, I found an island. Aha, I have yet to find an island. I'm currently being besieged by harpies, which is a and worry. And I do have a house and a chest. Nice. Get our little map oh, yeah, because sometimes you find them and they just don't have much on them. They've just got like a lake or something and that's it. Yeah. Which, I mean, a sky lake would be nice for some fishing. Yeah, we got the angler oh, quest, didn't we? Oh, that, what's uh, going on? Oops. <laughs> we got an angler quest that only us, it, it was it was basically like, go and fish in a sky lake. I was like, mm, we're a little, little far <laughs> away from that right now. Oh, I got a lucky horseshoe. Oh, nice. More so no, fall damage for me. No more fall damage for you. Awesome. That's good. That's All good. Right, that's the kind of gear we need to be getting at this here. point. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, what do I get rid of though? I already, I'm already full up. <laughs> I don't even know where I am at this point. I'm like out uh, in the I sky. I guess we'll get rid of the counterweight for now. All right. I have, I'm like surrounded by harpies now. I have nothing over here. All right, I'll just have to come back. Oh, oh, what do we have here? I think it's a house. Oh, fantastic. Good stuff. Oh, great. I was, I think I was cruising a little bit too high, maybe, but I don't know. Maybe yeah. I'll have to go back through and and check it out. Uh, what do we have? <gasps> oh, happy day. It's a Star Fury. <laughs> Amazing. Yay. Good stuff. Well, I can Very swap nice. out my ice blade for that. There's a bunch of silver, a sky mill, a few pretty standard potions. 
I'm going to tear up the furniture in here just in case NPCs decide to <laughs> use this as their house. But, oh, that's uh, right. <laughs> I did not do that. There's a couple of fancy banners up here. And they're not really going to do a great deal, but I'll take them. Yeah, get stuff, you read, harpies. <laughs> they're all grouping outside the door, and we can just, just pick them off one at a time. That's so good. And it does way more damage than my ice blade did as well. That's amazing stuff. All right, well, yeah, in terms of where I was on the map, I was maybe flying a little high, so oh, I can... there goes my gravitation potion. Oh, okay. <laughs> I almost died there. Yeah. Well, at least you've got the uh, the horseshoe now, so you don't have to worry too much about the oh, That's thing. right. Totally forgot about that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and I found another island. It looks like it's just a lake, though. Ah, oh, sad times. Still, at least we've got one of each. I think those, those are basically the only things we could really... Uh, the best things we could hope for from these islands. I'm not sure yeah. what else you get occasionally, but uh, yeah, I think um, I've definitely found a I couple without. The, you get the red balloon, or the balloons from... Yeah, yeah, so you just you? get like extended jump height and stuff, which is good, but at this point I kind of kind of wanted something like this to come through for us, so... Yeah, a good weapon is, is nice. These harpies are dodging Still, my... I, I would like a balloon. <laughs> dodging my stars. Alright, I'm probably going to have to fall my way back down and take my feather falling potion on the way. I'm star fearing it up right here. <laughs> but yeah, the harpies were getting a little bit too close for my liking, so I'm going to take shelter down here. Touchdown. It's like I've, I've gone farther than I've ever gone <laughs> out this way. Oh yeah, yeah, because you... I, I never I, made I was it the, to the uh, beach. I was the only one. Okay, recall potion time, zing. There we go. <clears throat> I had like six health left. <laughs> but yeah, oh, and the, there's uh, the edge of the map. The sea out there is very, very uninteresting. But that... That was not bad. Little, that was a, a nice... It, since I'm here. Yeah, you may as well, may as well uh, stare out into the sea. It's hitting me. You guys may also notice, for the folks at home, that you've, uh, we've got a an additional story to the house for our NPCs, oh. but I've also started decorating it with some more leaves, and the idea is that this is just going to be the trunk of a massive tree by the end of this, and it, it makes a, a bit of a difference to the standard NPC house where you're just building the whole thing out of wood, you know? So I kind of want to uh, to add to this and ornament it as we go and just make it like a, a giant tree build, even bigger than the giant trees we've already got in this map. Oh, yeah, that is a big sand cliff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's pretty huge, right? Yeah, Very unnecessary. Had that in the previous part, and yeah, that's uh, it's a little bit excessive for terrain generation. There might even be another island further out towards the the very edge of the map, so I will have a go. This red dungeon. I think I've always had just like the normal, oh, what's the normal color, green? I think. Yeah, I think I think um, it might actually change depending on what the world evil is on Expert. I could be wrong about that, but like I got, I had crimson on my normal, plant, my normal playthrough, but I still had like blue brick or something, so mm -hmm. I don't know if that's... I, uh, yeah, I think it's just random... Like, there's red, I think blue, and green. And it's just random, whichever one you get. Ah, oh, fair enough. So you got to start uh, multiple worlds to collect the whole set. Yeah. <laughs> I do not know how much help this Star Fury is going to be against the Eye of Cthulhu, but I fancy my chances a little bit more now. I've got full platinum armor, so... I don't know, maybe we could make it a thing. Oh, hello. We, we could possibly make it a thing. It's a lake island. Well, at least there's a giant lake there. Yeah, I found I found two islands on my side, and looking at the map, I think that's it, because I've covered the sky pretty well. Yeah. So I, I don't think there's any more hiding there. I'm just gonna try and get as Which far out. Which is kind of sad. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna try and get as far out as I can to this left-hand side, because we had the uh, the sea chest over here. Maybe this is just the better side of the map. <laughs> I don't quite know. <laughs> Traveling merchant. I'll just mirror myself back, see what this guy's got. Now that we spent all our gold. I'm gonna uh, have we got a DPS meter. Oh, nice. That's worth having. Five gold. I guess I'll... Yeah, I'll... I bought two of them. <laughs> <laughs> so that... We have them if we can ever make the cell phone. If we get separated. <laughs> okay, I'm going to ice mirror my way back home because I was right out of gravitation potions. And yeah, looking at the map, I'm 
pretty certain unless there's a one sky island lingering over the the sea right on the left hand side i think that's it for my half as well i really wish we could share map data it kind of annoys me that you can't do that on a co-op run but that would be really nice yeah just like having this massive empty space over here that you've uncovered <laughs> but uh how yeah. many uh how many um mana stars do you have i have uh one two three four five total okay i have six i'll give you oh. there's three more oh, mana nice. stars 160 total that's awesome nice i got 140 now so pretty good I'm going to like re-equip my depth meter in that accessory slot, because I'm not really using the counterweight thing for the yo-yo, and that gives me an extra plus four defense. So, <laughs> I'm doing pretty well right here. Very nice. We should also... Oh, that's that's what we should use the platinum for. We should be making watches. I can't remember oh, how yeah. much you need for that, but I think it's ten. Off the top of my head, I think it's ten. You need... Um, you need a chain as well. Where's the guide? I need to talk to the guide. <laughs> He's just hanging out over here. <laughs> By the squirrel. I feel like uh, we should have that then. Uh, platinum watch. Yeah, you need ten and a chain. So, I mean, you can we make a silver watch. Yeah, we do have chains in there. Oh, the platinum's gone. Yeah, I just a... I just took it, but it's uh, oh, it's only five stole, of five of the bars. It. I stole it. Yeah, <laughs> I, I have been making all of my armor and stuff out of it. So, forgive me, I am <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of an armor junkie right now. But it's, if anything, it's a uh, a good thing that we've got that, and we can probably find some more platinum, or just make silver watches oh, yeah. and get slightly less accurate time. You can make silver watches, and it just gives you less accurate time. Yeah, I think you, if you make a silver watch, it kind of does like five seconds at a time, or something like that. Let me see if that will do. Um, gotta make it at a table, right? Let's see. Yeah, here we go. Silver watch tells the time, and it goes seven, seven thirty. Is it going to say like 7.40? Or it just gives you like half past? Yeah, so it'll tell you roughly what the time is. That's interesting. Do you want me to make nice. you one? <laughs> well, I don't need one. I yeah. can read the time. <laughs> as long as I got you nearby, I got the time. Yeah. <laughs> You'd be like, do you have the time? Yes, it's 7.30 a.m. <laughs> or thereabouts. And yeah, I guess sure is. if we find more platinum, we can make a, a slightly more accurate timepiece. There we go. 8 o'clock. I'm going to disable the weather thing. The weather thing is just... I think it's only relevant when you've got, like, the angler quest and you have to fish during rain or something. I don't know. Underground Tundra is the quest fish. Yeah, well, we've got plenty of that down here as well, so do you want to go for that? We may as well. Yeah. While we're waiting for it to be night time, we should... Do we have a... Do we have a summoning item or anything? Do we have the... The... The eye, whatever it is? No. Uh, where's the nearest... Demon altar. There's a couple around. I'm pretty found. sure. Yeah, there was some in the in the underground desert, and the crimson obviously has a ton that's all the way over to the right. If we want to go there. Yeah, whichever one's gonna be easiest to get to. We should have plenty of lenses. Yes, I've got eight tons here. of them. It. I'm surprised we don't have more to be honest, but I guess we haven't done that much demon eyeball fighting. We've been doing a lot of caving instead. I'm still baffled that we haven't had a meteor st uh, spawn yet. It's so weird. Yeah. I don't think I've ever waited this long. Like, usually they're right away. It's supposed to be a 50% chance, so... I... Yeah, well, that I, was on the first night, wasn't it? After that, wasn't it less? And it's like an extra 2% each time after Oh, that. an extra 2%. Yeah, so it's not much, but... So what's going on? <laughs> Unless we missed it i don't think so i think we would have run into it at this point because yeah i pretty much I gone I just all the way to the right and, and you were over here a moment ago anyway yeah i was walking back quite a ways so it's definitely not on the right unless it was well no because i would have seen the meteorites i was gonna say sometimes like because it goes to wherever like a it, it goes to like the lowest point or whatever yeah in the terrain so it's possible that there's like a small hole that it just kind of sneaks itself into but you'd you'd probably see the little meteorite guys that 
spawn around it. Of course, the problem with demon altars is finding one that's not already encased in materials that I can't mine. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, another thing we could do is just uh, take those, because you have two extra heart crystals, don't you? I do. Could it increase our health if we're ready. Yeah. That's probably going to be a good plan. I've made the uh, suspicious looking eye though, so we are. Oh, nice. We are good to go. I managed to find myself a Crimson Altar and then zing the heck out of there. Don't know if I'm in the right biome. I'm not getting this quest fish. Underground Tundra. I mean, I, I can't imagine what's more underground tundra than where you are right now so <laughs> yeah unless maybe you're in like tundra caverns or something but that seems like a silly distinction to make terraria yeah, <laughs> yeah i wonder oh okay slime slime is falling from the sky Ooh. well <laughs> here's our first boss fight guess so are you ready? I think I'm ready. I've got a Star <laughs> Fury, which means I'm probably going to be decent at taking some of this stuff out. I've certainly got an awful lot of armor as well, so... And I'm coming back. Does King Slime do anything weird in expert mode? I, I don't think so. I think it's pretty easy. This is good. I, I need some slime. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the best thing about this event is just getting tons of gel. Yeah, I'm running into these guys all the time now and it's barely doing any damage to me because of the amount of armor and stuff I've got, so <laughs> that's probably good because I have a, a tendency to run into slimes quite regularly. The only problem with the Star Fury is that it is an auto-swing and I'm so used to the Ice Blade being auto-swing now. Oh, Ooh, by the way, blue slime. are you still using your Ice Blade? Yes. Because I have a slightly better one. It's got a better um, adjective. Mine is quick. I don't know what, what's I think yours. Mine is uh, unpleasant, so it's more damage, more knockback. Ooh. And it does 18 damage as opposed to 16, so... Might be worth having. I'm going to grab some buff potions just in case. <laughs> Maybe I'll eat some food. Some swiftness might not be too bad, actually. Swiftness, regen. Uh, do we have any iron skin? I don't think we do. I'm not seeing it here. No, I don't think we've made any. Well, let's remedy that if we can. What do you need for iron skin? I guess you need iron ore and we don't have any in here, which is fine because we've got yeah, tons in the chest. I... <laughs> do we have iron ore? Because I know I have, I have a habit of making the bars. <laughs> yeah, now that we got 23. It's I have, to, good. have to remember not to do that. Yeah, it's fine. I put uh, I put four iron skin potions in the chest. So help yourself. Nice. We'll probably need them for the Cthulhu fight. Not entirely confident about our chances there, but then I've never really fought him in expert mode, so I don't know what we're expecting. Yeah, I think the only difference is like at the end he uh, he like charges around a lot. Oh right, he gets a little he bit faster. Really fast. Maybe we'll get the, the slime mount. The slime mount is really good against Cthulhu because you can just like bounce on his head. And you just like jump over, over him. Over yeah, he'll actually, he'll like take you to outer space if you just <laughs> bounce on his head. You just bounce up and he'll keep flying up to you and eventually you'll just kill him. That sounds amazing. That way. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm thinking we need to do that somehow if we can, <laughs> can possibly manage it. 100th Hun blue slime. 100th blue slime. So we are... Not far off King Slime spawning here, I think. Should probably be hanging these banners up somewhere in here. Oh, 50th Breeze Slime. Uh, let me put that banner up. I've got two of those, so <laughs> hang them next to each other for now and then space them out if we need to, but it's not like we're really having trouble taking on slimes at this point. King Slime! King Slime has hey! a Logan. You Your ready? Majesty! <laughs> <laughs> Should I get out my mini shark? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tear through him. 
Oh, there he is. Wow, okay. <laughs> He's a big fella. I don't think I fought King Slime until, like, really late in my series. I don't know why. The Slime oh, really? Rain thing just didn't, didn't happen for me for a while. Excuse me. Oh. Oh, there's little spiky slimes that he's, uh... Yeah, those guys are kind of annoying. ...calling for help. Ah, this isn't too... Ouch. ...difficult. Oh. Ah. Yeah, if he... <laughs> no. If he gets on top of you, then it's a little bit <laughs> difficult, but oh... Yeah, I'm just getting bounced around. I'm gonna go heal with the nurse. Heal, there we go. And I'm coming back. And buff. I just really quickly need some better life regen than I have right now. Getting too far away from the campfire and all of the... The home comforts we have set up. <laughs> Keeping him at bay with the Star Fury, but it's perhaps not the best weapon to be dealing with him right now. Ah, oh, dang it. Ah, why am I, why am I swinging an axe? <laughs> it's probably not the best idea. Don't come in here. Oh, you <laughs> jerk. <laughs> I've killed so much blue slime right now. The guide is hiding yeah, in his hole again. Is, <laughs> I'm having a little trouble. And heal. My problem is my main thing is like a melee weapon right now, and I can't really get that much closer to him without him doing a ton of damage. Nope. Alright, just get around those guys, bring him back. <laughs> He's almost down. Less than 500 health. Oh, that was a good jump. That go. was a good jump by him. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now let's clear out the rest of these guys. Treasure bag. Treasure bags. Oh, amazing. That's part of expert mode. Okay, so this is new territory for me. Okay, you right-click to open it. Oh, hello. Guarding royal gel. Slimes become friendly. What? Oh, oh that's yeah. cool. <laughs> Oh man, all right, I'm having that. And I got the royal gel. Friendly uh, slime, yay! Why are you killing my friends now? <laughs> no, nothing too interesting. <laughs> I got a solidifier, a slime hook, ninja hood, Ooh. ninja pants. I think slime hooks are pretty good. Oh, what are you doing? You're sliming me. No. You're, you're all slimy. <laughs> he, he slimed me. Uh, so, ninja hood, ninja pants. What's, what is a slime hook? Is that any good? Is that going to be... Mm, actually, that might not be too bad. I can't remember. I, yeah, I think there's something good about that one, but I can't remember what it is. Maybe not. Maybe it's pretty similar. No pets or mounts. Very sad. Sad times. Or the, or the summon, the, the slime summon. Yeah. Uh, it is 8.30, so we could almost try for the Eye of Cthulhu fight now. We could. If you want to pop a couple more uh, heart canisters. Yeah, that would be helpful. Heart canister. Zing. Okay. Zing. So we're now we're now meeting the minimum requirements for that and the goblin invasion and a whole bunch of stuff. So. Uh, Fantastic. Gonna grab some buffs for this one. And yeah, what, do I should... what do we have? Uh, we've got regen. We've got swiftness. Iron skin. Um, I think that's all of the stuff that's going to be relevant. I'm, I don't know. I might want to get a better ranged weapon than I have because the Star Fury probably isn't going to be that helpful against him. I'm going to grab some javelins just in case, <clears throat> just so I have a ranged weapon. All right. Okay. So it is. It's ten o'clock. So we better summon him now. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do this. And we're doing it. I'm scared. <laughs> Well, at least we're a little bit maneuverable. At least we've got some good armor and we've got good maneuverability. Yeah, we should have maybe made some platforms. Yeah, that might have been a good plan, but... Oh, he's taking damage, though. He's taking damage. He is perhaps going to be a little bit difficult later, but as long as I can kite him out this way a little bit. That mini shock is tearing him up, dude. Yeah, if I can hit him, it works pretty well. <laughs> I wish I was doing more at this point. Okay, he's All transforming. Right, yeah. Second phase. And buff. I've not taken any damage so far because you've been absolutely Ouch. destroying him with the mini shock. I've been taking damage. <laughs> All 
All right, he's, I think he's about to charge real quick. Yep, Whoa, there he goes. okay, okay, <laughs> hello. That's crazy, but we are... Oh, okay, okay, hello. Yep, no, I'm, I'm not <laughs> taking any damage. He touches me and it's like I'm instantly healed again. Not to brag or anything, but <laughs> I can take this guy, no problem. Ouch, ow, it hurts me. It hurts, it hurts so bad, okay, try and- I don't and know if you can draw his attention at all. I'm gonna go try and heal real quick. Yeah, go talk to the nurse, I have got you right. covered for the moment. I'm coming back. I'm still doing a little bit of damage to him, he's- is he invulnerable when- yeah, he's invulnerable when he does that dash thing, but... It's possible. Dude, you're doing so much more to him than I am, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, stop. <laughs> He goes crazy no, it, it with seems that. Like he can do, I think he can do damage while he does that. You'd almost have to, otherwise he doesn't die. Yeah, he's not stopping, is he? Seriously, that did one point of damage to me just then. I am such a tank right now. Kind of wish I could get him to concentrate on me a little bit better. There, there we, we go. go. <laughs> Amazing. Yay. Two treasure bags in one session, no deaths. What is this? It's almost like get we can play here. Terraria. <laughs> yeah. And you beat the 50th zombie. Are we zombie. good at this or what? GG. Alright, treasure Ladies bag. And gents, treasure bag number two. I got. Oh, and I Sweden immediately mask. spoke to the guide. Oops. <laughs> I got Shield of Cthulhu. I got a shield too. Amazing. And some crimson seeds, which I will not be using. A uh, bunch of crimtain ore, which I guess is very useful. And. Yeah, allows the player to dash into the enemy. 31 melee damage. Wow, okay. Okay, I thought it was. I'm gonna I'm gonna take my slime gel off for that. That's that's awesome. Oh, and you can dash with it, and that's that actually like starts you off really fast. That's oh, I just killed a bird. <laughs> <laughs> the first thing I do with it is kill a bird. That's awesome. Oh, yeah, that amazing. Can be pretty useful. And it leaves like a little after image thing as well. That's so cool looking. <laughs> All right. Okay, nice. we are ready to tear ah, some diebird. stuff up. <laughs> Okay. I think we're pretty well prepared now. I think we are, yes. And I think with that, it's probably time to end this episode, folks. So thank you guys so much for watching Terraria. We had two boss fights in this episode and for the price of one. And <laughs> we thought we were just going <laughs> to get the one, but turns out King Slime turned out for us. Leave a like on the episode if you're enjoying the series. Subscribe to both myself and The Suck if you want to see more. And we will see you guys soon. Bye for now. Bye.